Here's how I made this dope wallpaper here in Photoshop. I'm gonna go with this artboard size and I'm gonna select the type tool actually. I can type in Panther and believe it or not, I did this effect with a Panther text. Press Ctrl J to duplicate the text layer. Select the top layer and go to the filter, blur and select motion blur. Convert a smart object and I'm gonna go with the angle on 90, distance 85, click OK. Let's select the second layer and I gotta go to the filter, blur again, and this time select a radial blur. Convert a smart object, push the amount all the way to 100%, click OK. And I gotta select the first layer, let's go to filter, blur gallery, and select spin blur. And as you can see, it added the circle here, and I gotta increase from the square, I gotta go all the way out and make sure that the text is 100% blurred out. And we're gonna go here to the center and increase this dial all the way up to 360 degree angles. There you go. And click OK. Now let's go to the top layer where the blur gallery is. Press and hold Alt and drag the blur gallery in the second layer and drop it above the radial blur right here. So it's gonna duplicate it. Now we're gonna double click on this blur gallery on the bottom text layer. Open it up and let's go to the center circle and decrease it somewhere around 70-80%. From here, let's click on the top layer, go to the adjustments, scroll down, select the gradient map, click on reverse, click on the gradient map, bring the black somewhere around here. And let's add another handle here, click on the color, change it to a sharper blue, click OK, add another handle here color. I gotta go with a purple-ish, something more lighter, click OK. Add another one here. This is gonna be cyan. And not but least, the white, I'm gonna make it a toxic yellow. Click OK. Now here you can pull the handles in order to adjust the composition. If you pull the black on the left, it's gonna reveal more from the circle. I'm gonna put it on the right and adjust it how you like. Click OK. Press and hold shift, select all the layers. Right click, convert smart object. Now I'm gonna crop it, select the crop tool, press shift plus alt, scale it down, and I'm gonna pull it to the right, also press shift at this crossing section right here. Double click release, go to the filter, noise, add noise, decrease the noise, something like that, click OK, and there it is. Thanks for watching.